Chris et Lucy. This dance piece was influenced by the French New Wave film movement, and the music was inspired by the film Amélie. Two friends who have known each other since childhood dance playfully together on a beach in West Sussex. The piece has a spontaneous quality. Each dancer uses different tempos, finding ways to be themselves, but also complement each other. Chris et Lucy is performed by two young dancers who are both white. Chris has neat, short-cropped brown hair. His open-neck shirt is of soft cotton with faded blue and red stripes. He wears it loose, with white knee-length shorts and white plimsolls with green trim. Lucy has long, curly, dark hair caught back casually behind her ears. She wears a slim navy blue top with short sleeves, calf-length navy leggings and a very short pale blue skirt. She's wearing red flip-flops. Outlined against a blue sky, two figures march to the right, one behind the other, along the top of a sea wall. Lucy is ahead. She strides out, closely followed by Chris. Jumping down, she leads the way along a narrow path, which runs towards us between clumps of dry grass. They stand together on a flat, sandy beach, with their backs towards us, gazing out to sea. Waves roll in gently across the sand. Lucy is holding her red flip-flops in her right hand. Lucy looks to the right as Chris puts his arm around her shoulder. She puts her arm around his shoulder. Still holding her flip-flops, Lucy turns towards him, putting her other arm around his neck. He dips and swings away under her arm. He runs his hand back over his short hair. They clasp hands. Chris bends his knees, legs astride, and dips under her arm. She spins to stand with her back to him. He rests his chin on her shoulder. Lucy leans back. He pushes her upright and she spins away. Chris turns to face her. He runs both hands back through his hair. He stands legs apart, one knee bent. Lucy rests on his knee, leaning back, her head on his shoulder. Chris crouches on all fours. Lucy spins and perches on his back, her knees tucked up. They both stand. Chris takes Lucy's hand, bends his knees and dips under her arm. Still holding hands, they lean away from each other. Standing behind Lucy, Chris rests his chin on her shoulder. She leans back, then lunges forward, touching the sand with her flip-flops. Chris puts both hands down. Lucy rests on his back, knees tucked up. They rise. Chris lifts Lucy's shoulder high and spins her round, her legs and arms spread wide. He lowers her gently and they both crouch. Dropping her flip-flops onto the sand, she dips under his outstretched arm. Lucy pulls away and they move together in unison, facing us, stepping to right and left with bent knees, arms flung wide, then twirling round and high kicking. They step, twist and kick, then stop and face each other. Chris lifts Lucy's shoulder high and spins her round, her legs and arms spread wide. They dance in unison again, this time one behind the other, stepping sideways with bent knees, twirling round and high kicking. Behind them, a wooden fence runs out along the breakwater into the sea. Fluffy white clouds float overhead. Chris stands behind Lucy and puts his chin on her shoulder. He propels her forward, then spins under her arm. Leaning on his shoulder, Lucy spins to face him. He puts his hands on the sand, kicks his legs up behind, then lands on all fours. She leans on his back, kicks her legs high. They both stand, bend their knees, straighten, spin round each other. Holding his hand, she leans away, taking dainty steps, toes pointed. Lucy spins on tiptoe. Chris turns away, picks up the red flip-flops and stands gazing out to sea. 
Behind him, Lucy dances alone, spinning and leaping, lifting and bending a knee, reaching down to touch the sun. Chris screws up his eyes against the sun. Lucy stops dancing and walks slowly towards Chris. As she reaches him, he turns and puts an arm around her shoulder. She does the same to him. Chris dips from under her arm and walks away. Now Lucy stands gazing out to sea. Chris sits on the sand, his back to her. Lucy still looks towards the misty horizon. Light shimmers on the surface of the water. Chris reaches up high with one arm, then crouches down. Lucy turns and watches him. He draws a curving line with his hand in the damp sand. Now wearing her red flip-flops, Lucy marches on tiptoe beside him. Chris kneels on the sand, one knee bent up. He looks up at Lucy. She is marching and turning, her arms in the air. He sways forward and back, reaches up and touches her shoulder, turns on the spot, still kneeling. He crouches on all fours. Lucy leans forward along his back, then rolls off sideways. Jumping up, Chris spins away as Lucy removes her flip-flops. She takes his hand and spins under his arm. He bends. She kicks high over his head. She passes him the flip-flops. He runs round her in a tight circle and hands them back. They move independently, spinning around each other. Now they start to move in unison, stepping sideways to right and left, both repeating the same movement. Legs wide apart, one knee thrown across, reaching high with the opposite arm. Lucy puts down the flip-flops. Resting one hand on the sand, Chris spins round then crouches low. Lucy dances alone, lifting a knee, spinning with arms gently curved, a leg extended, her long hair flying. As she dances, Chris walks around slowly in a wide circle, watching her. Her flip-flops lie on the sand. Lucy turns to face him. He reaches out and takes her hand. She spins under his arm, turns and high kicks over his head. Lucy jumps, her arms stretched up. He lifts her and spins her round, her legs and arms spread wide, then lowers her gently onto the sand. He skips away. Lucy follows and spins. They both step sideways, lifting a knee and kicking high, arms wide, moving together, stretching out and up. Chris puts his hands on her shoulders and spins away. He lifts her onto his shoulder, sets her down. She spins away, returns, and swings around him, hands on his shoulders. He ducks under her arm. She spins across to stand with her back to him. He rests his chin on her shoulder. Lucy leans back. He pushes her upright, and she spins away. He turns to face her. He runs both hands back through his hair. She stands in front of him. He rests his head on her shoulder. She leans back. He propels her forward, bends his knees. She sits on his back, slides off, turns and relaxes back into his arms as he lifts her, swings her round and sets her down. Chris runs around Lucy in a wide circle. She turns to watch him as the circle gets smaller. She puts on her flip-flops. He reaches the middle of the circle and sits on the ground, one knee bent up. Behind him, Lucy steps on tiptoe, wearing the red flip-flops.
Chris Elusi. Choreographers and dancers, Lucy Bennett and Chris Pavia. Camera, Jacob Bennett and Richard Bennett. Music, Jules Maxwell. Director and editor, Richard Bennett. A Five Seasiders production for Stop Gap Dance Company. Audio description by Di Langford, with technical support by Gary Giles.